What's going on guys? Welcome back to Fishing with Norby. It just started raining out here on Lake Gunnersville. It was sunny about 10 minutes ago, but a couple of awesome people invited me out. I'm out here with Carolina. How you doing? Good. And Lance. Hey everyone. And they invited me out today. Carolina's got her own YouTube channel already. How old are you? 14. That's awesome. How can these people find your YouTube channel? It's called She Fishes Bama. She Fishes Bama. All right, it's linked down below. Go click on it, subscribe to it. She does a lot of fishing. But we're, we're gonna start with some top water. These fish should be munching. It's pouring, it's been sunny, it rained earlier today. A lot of changing conditions. They should be eating. We're sitting here, some shallow grass. It's springtime. We're gonna start with top water. Buzzbait, frog. You ready? ready? Let's go catch them. Let's get it. On a little black and blue frog to start in this grass. That storm is a passing. My next one? It's on Chickamauga May May 20th. It's a Toyota. I might fish some sooner than that if, if it works out, but that's the next big one. Well, let's see if they bite now that the rain's passed. Normally if you're fishing open water and it's raining, like the buzz bait bites super good. But I feel like they just couldn't see your frog as good when it was really coming down there. Huh. Wow. You got one? Yeah. There you go. Out roaming in the cloud cover. Good job. Caroline's hooked up. First one of the day. That's how girls do it. That's right. <laughs> Nice. Did you say you made that bait? I did. Wow. Check that out. You poured it. Your own soft plastics. That's awesome. Show me Facebook page. Lip rip and lures. Uh -huh. Lip rip and lures. Good one. Nice. That's awesome. Maybe they don't want top water. Did you get a bite? There we go. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. That's a good guy though. That's a good honest guy. Yep. There he is. <laughs> oh my gosh. Little guy. Just a little baby. I guess. not out here yet these little humps and flat spots that are aren't that deep like this one's only six seven foot there's a bass but they'll stage on these after they spawn out sometimes wow that's amazing <laughs> That's really cool. Wow. Now I'll get my other camera out. Alright guys, we got us a double rainbow. I don't know if you can see the other one. It goes all the way across Browns Creek. That's amazing. You said you saw a triple? Yeah, a triple. Really yeah, you can't see it on the camera, but it's really faint. There's a double right here, and there's the start of a triple on each side. That's beautiful. Got us so good. That's awesome. Putting on a little crawl. This is the hoss crawl from Carl's Bait and Tackle. 
get 40% off through shop carls here we are here's kind of the edge where it starts fading we're gonna drag this in and out of the grass here I think it's good. I'll just turn it down a little bit. Okay. Kind of cast up on the grass and bring it off. Because we saw two bust out here. Ooh. I think one tapped it. This time of the year, when you're up shallow fishing like this, it doesn't help you much. Yeah. Like you like, you like open water fishing better? I, I don't know. Last year, that's about all I did because I, I didn't get to up in Missouri. You got one? There you go. You both are smoking me. <laughs> On the crawl or the worm? On the worm. Nice job. Let's check him out. Second fish of the day. Good Little one. baby. Yeah. Good job. That's a good choice right now, that little cutter tail worm. Mm -hmm. They love it. I think you did a good job picking this out and putting it on there. You got one? Nice. There you go. Yeah. yeah. It's the tag this time. <laughs> That's right. Flip it. There you go. Yeah. That a girl. Good job. That's awesome. <laughs> Trying to get the power poles to go down. There we go. Nice. That's a good one. Getting that ready? Yeah. Gotcha. Good work. Look at that one, guys. She's smoking us on the worm. I picked up the chatterbait. Stop here and fish it for a minute. That's awesome. I know. You guys are making me want a worm. <laughs> There's one. Yeah. On the sidewinder. Nice. Yeah. Thank you. Couldn't let you guys catch all of them tonight. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, thank you. Nice little guy. Had a great time fishing out there. Uh, super nice of Lance and Carolina for taking me out. You guys go follow her YouTube channel. That's so cool she's starting that. She's even pouring her own baits. That's amazing. That is a passion for fishing right there. And that's what I had at that age too. And I still have passion for fishing. But we were out there tonight and it poured rain. The sun came out, it poured rain again. And there were two different time periods where a rainbow appeared. And not only a rainbow, but a double, even a triple rainbow at one point. It was crazy. So I want to share Genesis 9:16 with you. It's God prom God's promise after uh, he flooded the earth. It says, whenever the rainbow appears in the clouds, I will see it and remember the everlasting covenant between God and all living creatures of every kind on earth. So God said to Noah, this is the sign of the covenant I've established between me and all life on earth. So uh, God's never gonna flood the earth again, but the rainbow is also like a sign of him showing his, his faithfulness to us. 
And just remember, he's faithful today, guys. And whatever you're going through, he's faithful. So we're going to get out of here for the day. Scout. Oh, you're cute. You want to close him out? All right. We're going to see you guys next time here on Fishing with Norby.